Saturday morning and it's the walk to where I've just parked up in Llandurnog and I don't know where I'm going to go I'm just heading out towards the Cludians Penaclodiae could do Moilartha, Moilvamai, Llanguivan Forest <laughs> Anyway, I'm just heading up towards the Cludians and I'll decide Well, I think I've got a rough idea. If I was heading towards Moilvamai, I'd have taken the road that I've just passed towards Hendra Ruith. Um, but I've decided to head towards... It's either Moil Arthur, which I'll show you now, it's there. Moil Arthur, the old ancient hill fort, or Penaclodiae which you can't quite see from here or the Kilford Byway could go there or the Llanguivan Forest <laughs> so I've narrowed it down Mulvamai, no I'm not going to go to Mulvamai it'll be one of them Moilartha, Kilford Byway Penaclothia, something like that onwards <laughs> where I'm going to end up, who knows watch out for the bramble ah, it's Penaclothia just coming into view now and a claw the eight. I could do that. I'll decide. Slanguivan Forest head there. And Moilartha is just, uh, well, just hidden out of view. So onwards. Okay. I walk to where? Moilartha. Flankwivan Forest or well Kilford Byway which is makes its way where are we along there and then up over towards Penaclothia or I could do the direct route for Penaclothia from Flankwivan Forest there up the top there so decisions it's one of them three. <laughs> Penaclothia, Kilford Byway, well, four, well, can't count Slangwivan Forest because I'll be going there anyway, either way, to get to the three destinations. Should I do Penaclothia? Moil Arthur? I'll decide. <laughs> Welcome to North Wales. The more direct route, if I was going to move on my, is down that way. But I've decided against move on my. I'll head up towards Llanguivan Forest. Llanguivan! Now this is steeper than it looks on camera. Take it from me. Certainly gets the old ticker going. <laughs> nice one. Bring it on. No eggs today. Okay, I'm at the uh, Kilford Byway. And made a decision. I'm going to do Penaclothia. Um, Coid Sanguivan starts there, or Sanguivan Forest. 
Um, I'm not going to do Moyla Arthur, which is over that way. That's too short a walk there. Moyla Arthur's a bit of a pimple, just climbing over that and down the other side. So, and there's two ways I can get to Penaclothe, either th up through Llanquivon Forest or down the Kilford Byway there. Two ways you can go to Circular Walk. I think I'll head that way and I'll be returning through Coed Llanquivon, just down there, or up there, the actual, but I'll be joining the road and then walking my way back down to Llandurnog. So, uh, that's the decision. I'm not doing Moilartha, do Penaclothe. The views shouldn't be too bad um, for the Vela Cluid in in a moment, well about half a mile, something like that. And then when I'm actually on Penaclothia you'll get the views again of the Vela Cluid because you, you'd be right, getting a lot of height and also looking towards the Wirral and Mersey side and what have you. But the views, like I say, shouldn't be too bad. And it's warming up now too. So it's Kilford Byway up over Penaclodiae, back down through Coed Llanguivan or Llanguivan Forest. Decisions, eh? It's tough, isn't it? Well, there's a bit of VOC, the Vela Cluid. Um, I'll just show you what I've packed up. Just Llandurnog. I've actually packed I don't know if you can see the car from here, probably, that's it there, is it? Anyway, it's there somewhere, just about on that road there, that way that car's moving now. It's probably past my car, I think that was it. Either that or it's a bush, but it's somewhere there, anyway. You can see how much I've walked so far, it's just a few miles, something like that. But I'll see a bit more of the VOC shortly. It's looking down towards Rithin. And that's looking down towards the coast, towards Rill and and did no great home and what have you. But I'll get a better view of that shortly. I've got about a quarter of a mile to go. Visibility, not too bad. Should be pretty good on Penaclothiae. Breeze has picked up. So keep going. more open now. Just give you a view of the uh, Vela Cluid. Get off my camera. <laughs> Flies. Yeah, it's the VOC. Um, hopefully Denby is there. Very job to see through the viewfinder. Um, it's on Durnog. It's there. And Rithin is just tucked away behind there. That's looking towards the coast. Towards Rill. Can't see the Snowdonia range. You would normally see the silhouette there. Hope you can hear me. You normally see the silhouette of the Clued, um, not the Cludians, the Snowdonia. This is the Cludians. <laughs> um, yeah, but uh, give you a rough idea of where places are and what have you. Get back quite breezy. I don't know. There's no rain forecast, but the summit of Penaclothia is up there, way back. Got quite a bit to go, yeah. Not met anyone yet. Unusual for a Saturday. Sometimes you you do get the odd two or three walkers that you pass, mountain biker and what have you, but not met anyone so far. It's starting to spot with rain now too. Got to watch where you put your feet as well. <laughs> this track is covered in sheep didgeridoos. Stinks as well. Yes, you. Very strong. Covered in it. <laughs> wow, 
it is strong too. Are you looking at me? <coughs> You're looking at me? Screechy gate time, I call this. There's a few of these on this spyway, and they always make a heck of a noise. You pull the lever on them, they always screech. <laughs> That's the reason I call it Screechy Gate. And there's Moiler Park mast coming to view there. This is Moiler, Moiler Park, I think, yeah. It's the TV mast. Well, about half of it. The top half's disappeared into the into the clouds. I got about probably about another mile, I think, and I'll be turning off and heading over that way onto the summit, which is somewhere up there, and then back down. And like I said earlier, I'll be coming. Returning through Coid Langwivan, which is Langwivan Forest. All being sheared, these sheep. Don't need their winter coats at this time of year. And you can just see a snippet of Bodfari. This is it. Old Fadi. And the byway, I show you, you can probably make it out there, the line of it. And it goes round the corner, and then I start climbing then over the top of Penaclodia. Visibility, hopefully, shouldn't be too bad. Although, saying that, it's starting to rain now. And it looks like it's closing in, but uh, anyway, keep going in it. He who dares. That's what I've packed up. Llandurnog. Looks a long way away. That's because it is. <laughs> I love it. Long distance walking is my forte. Done it for years and years and years. Can't beat it. I've still got quite a bit to go to. And it's raining. Okay, I'm leaving the byway now. Show you a bit of the Moiler Park mast. There's about two thirds of it, I think. Hidden in the cloud. Starting to climb up to the summit of Penaclothia now. There's one or two cars down the bottom there, there's sometimes there. Some people they park down here and they walk or they have it to Moira Park or that's just one car or up to Penaclothia. But uh, yeah, straight to the summit. Penaclothia I know. Don't know what the views are gonna be like, the weather's closing in. Right, <laughs> what a beautiful day. Um, yeah, the weather is closing in, I'll show you. That's the summit. Is there, hang on, where are we? Hang on, zoom out there. That's the summit there. 
So I've got a fair bit to go yet. Weather is closing in. Met office said no rain for Denby or North Wales and what have you until much later on today or tonight. But you've got to bear in mind where I am. North Wales, mountainous region, altitude, altitude with an attitude. It's not going to take any notice what the Met Office says. So, anyway, obviously, basically, keep going. So, this is the summit. Keep going. I'll probably just do a little film when I reach the summit because it looks like the visibility is pretty crap. And then I'll be dropping down then to Llangwyfan or Coy Llangwyfan, Llangwyfan Wood. So, I'll speak to you when I'm at the summit. Panaclodiae. Here. So that's it. Summit, Penaclodiae, including mountain range, North Wales, and I'm not hanging about. I'm not going to stay here because uh, the weather is really closing in now. So dropping down to Coed Llanguivan and then dropping down again to Llandurno. It's one thing, it's downhill all the way, literally all the way now, back to, back to Llandurno. So, heading on to Coed Llangwyfan. As you can see, weather is really bad now. Visibility is, is zero. <laughs> well, for the views anyway, just got a few hundred yards. But uh, it's no problem. So, anyway, obviously, basically, dropping down now to Coid Llangwyfan. You would normally see the Wirral and Liverpool, but not today. Anyway, onwards and downwards. Nice to have a bit of visibility. Okay, uh, dropping down, weather is closing in now. Dropping down into um, Coit Langwivan, which is that way. That's the Coit Langwivan at the bottom there as well. And I'll just show you where I've parked up. I'll show you where Slandurnog is, <laughs> where I've got to walk to now. Where I've parked up, which is there. Hopefully, if I zoom in, you'll be able to see some buildings, hopefully. Because I can't see anything on this screen. There, see, so hopefully you can see some buildings and houses and stuff. So, that's what i got to get to. That's my destination now. <laughs> Keep going. I'm not the only one. I'm not the only nutter. <laughs> and while I'm up here, just put my tripod down. While I'm up here, just give you a bit of a better view of Coed Llanguivan. Better view of it from here. So, keep going. Thank you. 
Well, as you can see, I'm just uh, leaving Coed Llanguiver now, joining the uh, the road. Weather is really closed in now. I'm sheltering under a bit of a tree here. Uh, the Kilford Byway, it's just round the corner. That's where I started on the byway. It's like a circular route over Penaclodiae through Coed. A very wet Coed Llanguiver behind me there. And as I say, joining the main road. So I won't bore you with my long walk my long wet walk back down to Llandernog. So I will end the video here. As always, thanks for joining me. Hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you in my next adventure.